Jared Brown, 10th hole, Twin Creeks Golf Club, third round, ACS Open. Jason Eldridge now. That's perfect. Down. Yeah, it's about twenty foot right. Eldridge for birdie. And read. Xavier Kempton on ten. Dana Hotenay. Should be okay. Chase Borland. I'll be alright. Samuel Nashar. It's a great drive. Can I see? Lunch. Dean Forrest. Great drive. Nicholas Ward now. It's working a little bit right. Maybe in the trap. Lips now. And that'll be fine. Ben Rollo. It's come out pretty strong. Lewis Killen. It's ideal. Jackson Bug Dowsey after making the turn in square. A great swing. Brad Fairclough. Three over the first nine, but he's swinging it very well. And hitting it very well. So after 45 holes of the ACS Open, we've got Kurt Burns. Two under for the round today, six under for the tournament, a commanding lead, six shot lead over Reese Oliver and Joel Shields. At even par, Blake Palmer at two over. Ben Rollo having a good round today at two under to be four over for the tournament and tied with Jackson Bogdalski. And Lewis Killen at seven over. Brad Fairclough eight over for the tournament. Blake Palmer on the tee. It burns. It should finish up all right. Should be able to go at it from uh, as far five for two. Reese Oliver driving now on eleven.
got some club on it, but it's a bit right. Gold shields. Certainly reach this bar fine too. He's powered it down the right. Maybe okay. And he's taken a bit off that, working a little bit right. A runner. Up, Palmer. Be good. Shot. This is Nick Ward on R313. Got a good round going. Not altogether happy with that though. Sam Nashar now. He's made four birdies today. Playing quite well. Dean Forrest now is in a very awkward position right of this far 313th green. He's having to putt it and unfortunately that's going too far. Now here's Nick Ward in a really difficult position after his tee shot on 13. Oh, oh my god! Shot, Wardy! That is so good! That's the best Sam Nash out for birdie. Stuart loops after a great tee shot. Has this for birdie Hi. and makes it. Nick Ward now for a miraculous par. Oh, he's just pushed it. Final group in this tournament we have Kurt Burns at one under for the round and five under for the tournament. We've got Joel Shields even par for the round and uh, even par for the tournament. And Reese Oliver is at even par today, uh, e uh, one under for the tournament. Blake Palmer even today, two over for the tourney. Looking pretty good. Jackson is one under for the round and that's another good chance for birdie.
Lewis Killen just left it out to the right a little bit. He's one over for the round, but it's only 18 feet from the hole. Benny Rollo one over at the moment. It's on the green, he's not happy. Brad Fairclough just going for the centre of the green there. One over the round. If that's there, it's real good. It looks that's a great line. That's a little right of the green. Should be a pretty easy up and down. That's a good line. Oh, that's close. Kurt started that right. He's had a disappointing last couple of holes. He's gone double bogey, triple bogey. So Reese, square for the 20. Two shots Get up, get up, get up. Great job, mate. Well done. Kurt now two under for the tournament, leading both Joel and Reese by two. Part. Oh, yeah, right. Now he's within one. Blake Palmer goes back to even par for the tournament. Jackson Bug Darcy closes with a birdie and two under round of 70 today. Brad Fairclough for a closing birdie. Even par round of 72 for Brad today. Lewis Killen finishes. Disappointing 73 for Lewis. This is Joel Shields' ball on 18. Buried in the bunker. Disappointing miss there for Kurt. Two over 74 today, two under for the tournament.